US completes first B-61-12 bomb tests using B-2 Spirit Stealth Bomber. The U.S. Department of Energy's National Nuclear Security Administration NNSA, and the U.S. Air Force completed two non-nuclear system qualification flight tests of the B-61-12 gravity bomb on June 2018 at Tinapa Test Range in Nevada. These qualification flight tests demonstrate the B-61-12 design meets system requirements and illustrate the continued progress of the B-61-12 life extension program to meet national security requirements said Brigadier General Michael Lutton, NNSA's Principal Assistant Deputy Administrator for Military Application. The achievement is also a testament to the dedication of our workforce and the enduring partnership between NNSA and the U.S. Air Force. The tests involved releasing a B-61-12 non-nuclear test assembly, which includes the NNSA design bomb assembly and U.S. Air Force acquired tail kit, from a B-2A spirit bomber operated by the 419th Test and Evaluation Squadron at Edwards Air Force Base in California. These tests are the first such end-to-end -end qualification tests on a B-2A spirit bomber for the B-61-12. U.S. Air Force officials announced trials with the B-61-12 were progressing successfully. We've already conducted 26 engineering development and guided flight tests, said Lieutenant General Jack Weinstein, Deputy Chief of Staff for Strategic Deterrence and Nuclear Integration. The program's doing extremely well. The F-35 Lightning II Joint Program Office has also been working on integrating the latest modification into its weapons arsenal. The F-35 was designed with a requirement to carry a nuclear payload. In 2015, an F-35 flew with the B-61-12 to measure its vibration in the aircraft's weapons bay. The tests are part of a series of joint tests to demonstrate both the aircraft's capability to deliver the weapon and the weapon's non-nuclear functions. The flight test included hardware designed by Sandia National Laboratories and Los Alamos National Laboratory and manufactured by the Nuclear Security Enterprise plants. The tail kit assembly section was designed by the Boeing Company under contract with the Air Force Nuclear Weapons Center. The B-61-12 LEP will consolidate and replace the existing B-61 bomb variants in the nation's nuclear stockpile. Originally first introduced in the mid-1960s, the B-61 is a 700-pound bomb with a blast yield of between 0.3 to 50 kilotons, depending on mode. Some 180 B-61s are deployed throughout Europe. The Pentagon plans to deploy its B-61 Mod-12 bombs at military bases across Europe. The B-61 Mod-12 nuclear gravity bomb is expected to be made compatible with the F-35, and to, replacing existing variants of the B-61 in the U.S. arsenal. The weapon will also be carried by the B-2 Spirit and its successor, the B-21 Raider, which is currently under development. The Congressional Budget Office estimates that Washington will spend $25 billion on the modernization of its tactical nuclear forces over the next 30 years. The first production unit is on schedule for completion in 2020. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.